Folks, you got to see this. I just found something absolutely fantastic about this setup. Uh, right now, I got this hooked up to a wall wart, and I'm getting 0.9 watts. That's the wall wart. That's the power the wall wart is drawn. Now, I'm going to focus in on the setup right now. Goes up, and there's a, there's a connection for the wall wart right there. I got a little connection up here. And here's the setup. Okay, I got my lights hooked up to the power box. And over here, and I'm going to get into the picture in a minute, is there's a big, there's my coil, and right above it is a, is a, uh, a plant pot. It's plastic, and I'll show you the inside of it, show you there's no hidden gimmicks or nothing. There's nothing hidden in here, by the way. Well, I just want to show you this. Empty. It's a regular old plant pot. And I'm going to put that over this coil. Now watch. Okay, it's over the coil. Now here's my... I'm going to put this in here. Here's my magnet. I'll show you there's nothing hidden on the bottom of it. I'll put that here. You have to start with a spin. Watch this. Watch this, baby. And right over here in the picture, I'm going to take a, take a reading when the RPMs kick up. And boy, they will kick up. Believe me on this thing. Starts. I don't know what the top end is. I'm sort of afraid. I don't want this magnet to leave that shaft. And it wants to. It's already starting to walk on here. Okay, I'm going to take a reading of that thing right now. Seventy RPMs. That's what that baby's reading right now. That thing is honking on out, buddy. I'm scared. I'm afraid that right now I'm shaking because I'm afraid that thing's gonna leave. I'll leave. I'll leave this thing. I'll leave the holder it's in. I'm gonna try that again. I'm gonna take another read. You can hear it revving up. shut this thing down because I'm afraid I'm going to have problems. So, so I'll, just, I'll just take magnet off of here and let it coast over here to one side, put it way out of the way here. And notice that it's still spooling. I don't have I don't have that iron wheel or anything, any of the rest of the setup in it, but I'm just showing you that this magnet is capable of honking on out like you just see. And that's a two inch magnet. If I ever leave that shaft, that thing will walk across the room and punch a hole in the wall. And I, I'm thank God I have it uh, fastened pretty good. But uh, it's still spooling up. Even with this, it's, it's, it's winding down, but I got to get it way away from this coil. I wasn't aware that it would do that. Before, I used to have it on top of this coil, and I'll do that right now. I'm done with this RPM uh, tag. Let me get this out of the way. I'm still shaking because I don't want this to blow up my face. And I'll put this back down here and watch. This is how I normally had it before, folks. And it's doing this little 
put a little easy stunt like that. But when you take that thing up in the air, let me try that. Let me let me take this up again. And I'll carry it with my my fingers. Take it up. Watch how it spools up. It takes a little while, but boy, once that baby goes up, it starts honking on up. Put that, I'll put that thing, I cover it back on there again. It has some, some, some effect, but I don't know. Something was going on. Look at that, stuck that cover on it. That's just a plastic cover. There's nothing. And look at it. Look what it's doing. Figure that one out. And this is just plastic. I don't know. What do you huh? what do you think folks? I think I'll cut the cut it off right now and maybe you get some opinions on this. <laughs>